that's what Mike is. Yeah. So we're gonna have uh, Din versus Jet. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no, I don't wanna watch this. I hate this game. I hate this game too. Okay. So Marth Puff. They're gonna go straight to the battlefield. They're not even gonna bother doing straight strikes because they know they're gonna go straight to the battlefield. I played his Jigglypuff the other day. Mm -hmm. How was it? I I beat it, you know, I suck it, but I beat it a few times. But it could definitely it could it can do puff stuff. Can do puff stuff. Does not rest out of shield. He does not rest out of shield? He could do it. He showed me he could do it, but he does not do it a lot. Well, I mean, it's kind of like a hard commitment, and I would definitely turn the fucking timer on on this, I'm just saying. See that right there? He was trying to bait out a grab, that's what that side step was. Oh, he definitely could have rested there, but it's like it's a... I was a, expecting the rest. Oh, the neutral B. I'm enjoying it. So, Pixel doing a really good job of playing neutral and staying back, throwing out aerials, because uh, I think Alex... Well, Alex thinks that Marth is the best character in the game. He blatantly can't be the best character in the game, I'm just saying. Because he doesn't have a down B. Well, he has a down B, but it doesn't blip. So, well, that doesn't what's matter. What's Marth's kill move going to be? It's going to be four In match? this matchup, uh, he has to get really hard reads. Nothing really combos. Uh, and you see, like, when, death, when Puff is at death percent, you see Marth's going for, like, uh, side B and up tilt. And when you get a grab, you kind of have to, like, get an F smash off of it. Uh, that was a really high, really high. Uh, With his puff, you have to play patient. You have to play very, very yeah, you have to play patient against every puff. His, I don't know. No, I, like it's literally the, yeah, every, every puff. puff. The thing oh, he just got a smash. Yeah, right he, did, he does do reads, which is amazing. What's he gonna do? Every situation. But a lot of times I kill him with just random stuff, like charged up forward smashes. And, but. Dog is for stock and he's just bringing the damage into uh, that mark. Though. Just one good hit can really just get the mark away. Oh, uh, we tried to go, go for the hard read on the F smash. Sidestep, F smash, actually gets him killed. Well, oh, just rocks up and F smashes the David Lover, the signature David Lover. DM. Alright. Alright, so, not um. Right there, just kind of really isn't. I, I, I would recommend, like, not. Oh, that was really sick. Side B into uh, grab. I really don't want him going near the ledge at all, because that's, like, Puff's best on the stage. He's trying to stay in the middle. He's trying to get some hits in. Back air to up air. This could be that. Yep. Puff, the master at edge guarding. He can go out there. She can go out there. Just back air you and take the kill, which is on, like, Every single character in the cast, not just Marth. Marth definitely wants to grab, which I can't blame him. I mean, he can't. He can't. He wants to grab, but he kind of has to be like you risky about his grab. Because yeah. like right there, if you were to grab and Jet was to just like crouch, Marth's jab, Mar Marth's grab goes over yeah, and his crouch, and he can just get rested. Rest. Yeah. That's happened to me a few times when I played him. On the second stock though. This is two down tilts. He does want those up tilts on Daily Puff, because that could be just an easy rest starter. All those back airs might be his death, but he does a dash attack instead of doing get another. He doesn't go for uh, a down tilt. Not go for a down tilt. I like the neutral B option. I respect it. Nice wave dash back, waiting on the jump, gets the F smash. Uh yeah. Alright, do we ever press start? Yeah, I do. Play against Chris. So, uh... Where do you think he's gonna counterpick to? Uh, definitely not Dreamland. He should the definitely Yoshi's. ban Dreamland. I would, I would probably take him to Yoshi's, to be yeah, honest with you. Small, smaller stage. Because Alex isn't really running away. He's kind of staying in his face. So... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just T-Rex. No, it's not T-Rex. Then I don't know who, I don't know who just... Yeah, he is. I don't know who Chris is. DQ! No, I'm just kidding. Man! I don't know who Chris is. We'll figure it out. So, for the next game, uh, Alex, probably gonna switch off. Oh, he switches to Luigi. This is also a really bad matchup. He just has to space his life stuff. I did not want to see this tonight. But... So, Din definitely knows about Luigi. Because uh, those wave dashes, yeah, he's, yeah. De he's definitely doing the correct thing, staying out of Luigi's uh, wave dash, 
distances and punish him out of the aerials. Oh, that was sick. Wave dash, I could just go right in your face. Where's it, where's it gonna have to beat him out at? Because Ouija has some really good aerials. Uh, pretty much just bait out his aerials and then hit him with an FA or something. You have to. Mart's matchups versus floaties is like a war of attrition. So, because like, nothing, I, nothing combos at like what 70 percent. So you just play neutral, a bunch of neutral, and you have really good neutral, and you're very very patient. You can win this matchup as Marth, because this is like a seven three matchup for Marth. Oh yeah, you want yeah. those hits too whenever you're Marth, because you get one ups like one up air like that, you just want more, but you have to really play it, because you're not gonna get anything off of it. Oh, the mind dance. That's yeah. Deep. Uh, definitely tried the wave dash back, but uh, if you're really close to the ledge, you have to be really strict with your wave, da with your wave dashes, because if you don't, that'll happen. Yeah, you can't be doing aerials like that. And that's the thing about this matchup, uh, Marth can kind of, if his aerials are where spaced, if he has well spaced aerials, he can definitely aerial uh, Luigi on shield and just poke him. It's one of the few matchups where he can do that because Luigi has tiny arms just like Dr. Mario. But his wave dash does cover a lot more distance, so you have to be very wary of that. Oh, yeah. oh tries to go for an up B. It, um, it legit almost shield poke too, so that would have been spooky. I really think nice down just, tilt. He just wants to like misfire, I think it's the real reason to play the Luigi. Nice wave dash back, F smash from uh, Din. Realizing that uh, Alex wants to throw an aerial out from the ledge and just waits. Nice uh, nair into re grab, but Alex just Warrior does a four. Oh my, oh my god, gosh. that was almost a sick person. nasty. But uh, the side B, Alex trying to go for a style, ends up getting taken, losing his stock, the re grab and the nair. Another aerial on shield getting grabbed by Alex from Alex. Nice down smash. That wasn't sick down smash. And four there takes a star. That's another thing, uh, Luigi can like quote unquote combo breaker. A lot of his moves are considered combo breakers because you get nared out of them. And, He's uh, trying for that. Uh, can I go for another? Uh, I think I'm all game. I hope he doesn't get one at all. Yeah, he might, just because it's Luigi. Just because nice up smash. Oh! oh. <laughs> F smash. Everybody in the Oh room. my god, we all saw it. We all saw the memes about to happen. Oh my god, that's actually a legitimate punish, dude. You can't, you can't do that. Din should have punched him in the face for that. How do you know how to play Luigi?